hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello. Do you hear me, guys? Hello. Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening. How is it going, guys? Okay, how are you? How is it going? It's like, how are you informally? Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Milagro. Good evening. Okay, great. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Mr. Byron Aquino, good evening. Great to hear you again this second day of class. Thanks, okay. teacher. Okay, not a problem. Good. Uh, let's see. Mm, let's see who else. Carlos, Carlos Dimas. Hello, Carla Flores, Jose Mario, Carlos Arias. Goku is the picture that you have. Hello. Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Carla. Welcome. Uh, Milagro Janice is online too. And Ana Maria Carias. Okay. Excellent. Uh, it's already 8 o'clock. 8 p.m. o'clock. Okay, we are, you are sharp, 8 o'clock sharp. That means at the time, a la hora, 8 o'clock. Okay, um, hello guys, uh, welcome to the second day of class. How was your, your day? Tuesday, how was it? Good? Nice? Normal day? It's normal day. Normal mm -hmm. day. Normal okay. day. Good, good. Hey, hey, what about the what about the rain? Is it raining where you live at this moment? It's been mm -hmm. raining in the afternoon. No teacher. Okay. This moment, cool. no teacher. Okay, perfect. That's better. That's better because when it rains, uh, the rain affects the internet connection. And we know that. But perfect. That is not raining where you live. Okay, uh, let's see how many are we? How many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. You are eleven, and with me, we are twelve. Twelve people. Okay, but it's early. Eight and one. Okay, hey, did you did you receive the the message in the group about the platform? About. The platform about the about the exercises about the assignments. I saw in the chat that someone in charge is sent a message that that you need to complete or work on in the section number four and number five in two sections this week. Uh huh. Did you did you receive uh, the message? No. No. No t-shirt. No. no. Really? Oh, yes, okay. Yes, teacher. Ah, okay, Sofia says yes. Only Sofia, but we are in the group. Everyone is in the group, I guess. Uh -huh. Okay, depending uh, about the messages that are sent in the group, some of them are very important. Hay que estar pendientes ahí de los mensajes del grupo. Okay. Uh, dice mm -hmm. de, de los assignments de la unidad 4 y 5, ¿ok? Eh, que se debe trabajar en ellos. This week, ¿ok? But we have two weeks of classes yet. We have two weeks of classes. Let me confirm that. Déjeme confirmar eso, si solo es la sección, la sección 4 y la 5, o si solo es la sección 4. Porque vamos con dos uh, weeks de clases, ¿verdad? Dos weeks, ¿sí o no? Yes, teacher. Uh -huh. Yeah, we have Pero ahí están weeks. pidiendo en la aplicación que se pueda avanzar hasta parte de las cinco. Ok, ah, yeah, that's something important to mention. Algo importante que mencionar, sí. No necesariamente que veamos una clase, usted hace un ejercicio, clase, ejercicio. No, usted puede avanzar lo más que pueda en otra sección. Así tiene el material cubierto y, y puede eh, reforzar, ¿verdad? Con, junto con las clases y los, los assignments que están ahí. Lo estoy diciendo en español para que quede 100% clear. 100%, 100% claro, ¿ok? 
eh, sí, usted puede avanzar lo más que pueda en otras secciones, adelantar, etcétera. No necesariamente que clase ejercicio, clase, clase ejercicio, no. Eh, se puede avanzar también, así que no hay ningún problema con eso. Ok, good. Uh, welcome, welcome, Rafael. Let's see, uh, Reina is online too. Uh, Mr. Eliezer Marroquín, welcome, Reina Vázquez. Ok, welcome, hello, Ivania. Good hello, hello, good evening, welcome. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, ok. Uh, okay, it's already eight and four minutes. Let's begin our second class of the week. Okay, uh, let me begin sharing the monitor with you. Okay, uh, just uh, let me activate that option in Zoom that lets me share the monitor with you. Okay, uh, confirm, confirm, please, if you see it, if you see yes, my, my screen. Yes, oh, yes we have a different, we have a different picture. Nice. Okay, yeah. uh, it's mm -hmm. not very colorful as I like them, but we have uh, some animals. I guess that is, uh, those are, because it's plural, those are. Those are uh, orders. Orders is, uh, do you know the meaning of order? The animal? Order? No. 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 Uh -huh. No. The, uh, this is the word. Order. Okay. What is that? The animal is? Um, just Scorpio. let me type it. Uh -huh. Correct. Yes. That's the one. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Order. order. Those are orders, orders in the river. And nice. they seem that they, they are enjoying the, the swimming. Cool. Okay. They live in the water, <laughs> by the way. They live in water. Good. Okay, good. Uh, with that introduction, let's uh, share today's class. Okay. We have uh, class number, number nine, right? Yes. Number nine. Number nine. We are advancing. Yes. We are advancing with the, with the level. Okay, how have you felt these classes, guys? How have you felt them? Are you learning new things? Are you improving your English? Uh -huh. Is there anything that you like about those these classes that we are taking in this level? Share, you can share. You are very creative, creative? Ah, you mean creative. Creative, that's uh, uh, an adjective, okay? Creative. Yes. If you repeat it, okay? Cre like this, creative. Creative, like Creative. This. Creative. 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 Uh, let's see. Creative. 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 Yeah. Creative. 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 Okay. Creative. Thank you. Creative. Thank you very Creative. much for telling me that. Okay. That's a compliment. Creative. For me, thank you. <laughs> okay, compliment. Okay, what's a compliment? In Spanish? Uh -huh. Compliment? No, nobody? Nadie? The meaning? No, no. Teacher. Okay, it's similar, similar in, into Spanish. Compliment. Compliment. Complimento. Complimento. Complimento, no. No, complement is complemento. En complemento. Cumplido, yes. Cumplido. Ah. Correct. Okay, cumplido. Okay, thank you, thank you very much. Okay, uh, the thing is that I like that the classes can be uh, entertaining and yes. with different topics, okay? Because we can learn from many things, many, many things in English, okay? And I hope that you like them until the end of the, of the course. Okay, great. Um, as you know, you can uh, make questions Okay, let's uh, advance with the with the things with the slides. So we have them. You know those indications already. Ya la saben. Okay, we are not gonna repeat them. And if you have questions, ask, ask, ask. Always ask. Okay. Uh, the four areas. Ah, yesterday you participated a lot, and I liked that. Okay. The first one is. Speaking. Speaking. Speaking for many people is the most difficult part 
and when you are learning English. That's why we need to practice every class. Okay, and number two is listening. Listening. Grammar. 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 Listening. Always. Grammar. Uh -huh. practice. 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 Yes, okay, practice. perfect. Okay, practice, practice. Okay, let's see today's topic. Which one is going to be? Okay, the topic is? Describing people. Describing correct. people. Correct. Oh, you pronounced it correctly. Describing. Perfect, perfect. Describing. Okay. How would you describe her? How would you describe this girl that we have in the picture? How would you describe her? Okay. Uh -huh. Describe is give a description. It can be about a physical appearance, about the appearance, okay? Or it can be about the way you are inside. But we are going to be speaking about people, people's appearance, okay? From an outside, de afuera, okay? How would you describe her if you know the vocabulary? Any idea? She uh, is. She her younger. She okay. has she is... hair. Okay, she is young. She's, she's young. Okay, she's young. Ah. Repeat. She is young. She's she is young. young. Yeah, younger. Young. Why not younger? No younger because younger is a comparative, and uh... we don't, we don't have we don't have another person to compare with it, with her. So she is only one. Mm -hmm. That's why is she is young, correct? It's and true. what else? She, yeah, she's young. Mm -hmm. uh -huh, she's young. She, she has a long hair. Uh, okay, she has. Repeat, she has. She has, she has. long she hair. Has. Long, long hair. hair. Okay, she long has long hair. hair. And she has high hair. She has. Can you repeat it? She is high. Okay, she has. She has a... uh -huh. Okay, she has or she is. We have two options. She has or she is. Mm -hmm. She is tall. She is tall. Okay, yeah, we can see. We can notice that she is a person that is tall, correct? She is tall. Bird to be, perfect. Bird to be. And what about the skin color? How can you describe a hair skin color? Brown. Do you say pale? Excuse me. Can you can you repeat it? Or do you say pale? Ah, uh, skin. S K I N. Is skin. Skin black. Skin. black. Skin black. Black. Skin white. No. White. Skin white. No. White. Uh -huh. she, has. she has. She has. White, the color white. White, white skin. White, white, white skin. skin. White skin. Piel blanca. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we can we can use it, but we are going to learn precisely that vocabulary that is gonna help you to describe people. Okay. Great. He has. Mm -hmm. He has a beautiful smile. Ah, uh, smile. 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 Repeat. Smile. smile. It's okay, nice. yeah, perfect, perfect. She has, she has, okay. She has a beautiful smile. Okay, that's it, very good. Um, okay, no more? No more, right? Mm -hmm. About the appearance. She has, she has a finger, long. Uh, long fingers. She has long fingers. Long fingers. Uh, yeah. Blue okay. eyes. Uh, yeah, we can say that. That she has oh, blue eye. blue eyes. Mm -hmm. She has blue eyes, correct. Okay. She good. sing. She is? She is sing. She is sing. Mm, what do you Delgada? mean? Delgada. Ah, thin. Thin, repeat. Thin. Thin. Ah, thin. 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 Correct. Okay. A zapato from Spain is a pronunciation for thin. Thin, repeat. Thin. thin. Thing. Okay, thing, yeah. correct. Okay, good, thing. perfect. You did great. Uh, the first one is? Mm -hmm. Young. She's young? young. She is She's young. young. She is She's tall. tall. She's tall. She has, she has long, 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 long hair. Red hair. 
Okay, yes. we can use colors. We can use colors uh, yes. about describing parts of the body or in general about people. Okay, great. And let's continue describing people when when describing, when describing someone's, someone's appearance, 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 we describe, we describe okay. let's repeat, right. appearance, appearance, appearance. Yeah. Right. Okay. Appearance. appearance. Physical physical appearance, correct. Okay. Appearance. What can you what can you describe uh, about someone's appearance? Uh -huh. hair, 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 the hair, hair. Eyes color, eyes color, color, skin color, color. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, no, that's not the way. Hey. Okay. Is the height. 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 I have doubts, teacher. Okay, let's see. Mm -hmm. Height. 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 The degree to which something is high for someone is? So. Okay, good. It can be used uh, with uh, general things and with people. Okay, about the height. In uh, Spanish, what is the meaning of height? Alto. Uh, the noun, the noun, not the adjective. We uh, have noun and adjective. Estatura, correct. Uh. Okay, that is a noun. Perfect, perfect. Okay, good. Uh, let me go back with the presentation. Okay, what else about uh, this one? Can you repeat it again? Uh -huh, repeat height. It. Height. 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 Hair length. Hair length. Hair length. Hair length. Hair okay. length. What, is, what is the hair length? What is the hair length? Uh -huh. El largo del cabello. Lo largo, la... Uh -huh. Lo largo. Medida del cabello. La medida, etc. Yes. Okay, you get it. Okay, perfect. And uh, what else? What else? Body shape. Body, body, body shape. Body, body shape. Body. Uh, body, body body shape. shape. What is the body shape? Okay. Uh -huh. What is body shape? Uh, la uh -huh. forma del cuerpo. Correct. Body shape. Correct. And body. face. Face and, other Face and other parts. Other parts. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, we can describe a lot of things. Let's see. Let's advance. Describing people, the first uh, that appears in the in this slide is about age. 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 Okay, age. it's about age. age. Okay. Age. Let me see. Uh, let me request uh, some help from someone in the class. Um. Let's see, Rafael, your microphone, please. Okay, thank you. Let's see, Ivania Gomez. Is Ivania Gomez in class today? Yes, no, maybe. Yes, teacher. Okay, perfect. Un poco arripada. <laughs> oh, I'm really sorry. You got flu. Yes. You got flu. Okay, we are gonna we are gonna skip your turn. No problem. So you can rest. Okay, no problem, Ivania. I know okay. that you got flu. Fatima, maybe. Okay, no problem, Fatima. Mm -hmm. uh, drink beer, viral grape. Okay, drink a peel, a viral grape. Uh, tea, tea is good too. Fatima, no. Brenda de Vialta, maybe. Participation. Remember, participation is always important. Uh -huh. Maybe Carlos Dimas, Reina. I have Gabriela, Byron. For this uh, paragraph. Me, teacher. Okay, okay, go ahead. Is you is your or you my have a passion so you um all I pensioner or a senior senior mm -hmm. senior citizen and um, all person might be uh, six five years old and over and over okay. Okay, perfect. It's uh, talking about uh, someone who is a pensioner. What is a pensioner? Uh, maybe your grandmother or your grandfather. They are pensioner because they are pensionado. They are, uh, they are older. They are over 60 years old. They can be over 65. Okay. 
In other words, those are old person, but old person is not a proper term. We are going to learn that. Okay, continue, please. Me, teacher. Okay, okay, Byron, go. Go ahead. Before. Before you are old, around 55, for example, you can be middle-aged if you have children when you're this age, they can be young, adult, 20, 25 years of age, or teenager, 13, 19. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Okay, it says an old person might be 65. For example, if you look at the picture, uh -huh, we can see who is the pensioner in the picture. Who is the pensioner for you? Uh -huh. Senior. The senior. senior, okay, the senior, senior, correct. Okay, another word that you can use instead of old, in lugar de decir old, okay, because old means, what, does, what is the meaning of old? Uh -huh. The meaning of old is? Hmm? Viejo. Is, viejo. Viejo, correct, viejo. Uh, but it's not proper, it's not very polite. So you can use, instead of old, you can use? Senior. Senior, senior. A senior person, or you can say? Elder. Elder, elder, elder or? Pensioner. 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 You have three options, okay? Instead of old, senior. okay, um, senior. Okay, I saw a senior person crossing the street the other day, you can say. But an old person, mm, not much, no mucho, okay? Because mm -hmm. he's impolite. Okay, good. Mm. And the next one is middle, middle age. The, what is middle age? Who is the middle age in the picture? A, a woman. Uh, the a woman, the woman, the woman wearing a, a light blouse, a light blue blouse, correct. A young adult woman in the years are between which ones? Entre cuantos? Which years? 20, uh -huh. 20, 25, 25 years, of, years age. of age, okay, or teenager, 13, 19, 19. 13, 19, do you see any teenager in the picture? Teenager, yes, uh -huh. the, the guy, okay, the guy, okay, then maybe, maybe he is uh, 13, 14, 16, 17, 18, and 19. 19. Until there. Until there. That's why it says teenager, because years can be from 13 until 19 years old. Okay, uh, continue. There are. There are other words mm -hmm. for younger children, for example, uh, to... toddler. Uh -huh. Toddler is around uh, one, one to three. three. Years old. Years old. Well, uh, baby from two, mm -hmm. uh, 12 months, 12 months old. old. Okay, a baby is from zero to 12 months old. That's a baby. But a toddler, uh -huh, a toddler is which years? A child. Uh, a child. Uh -huh, you can call it a child. Call him or call her a child. But there is a, the other word, toddler, okay? Mm -hmm. Niño, toddler, mm -hmm. okay? And those are some words uh, that you can use to describe people's age, all right? Good, good? Yeah. Okay, perfect, perfect. You can study these uh, more with, with time. So you can study and practice a little bit more. Uh, okay, next, the next one we have, describing people, next. Physical, physical appearance. 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 Physical appearance. Okay. Uh, we have build. 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 Body. Body shape. Body, body shape. shape. Okay. Any, any volunteer for this part? Volunteer participation. Me, teacher, okay. Carla Flores. Okay, Carla. Thanks. Okay. People are built in all shapes and size. There are two who are fat and overweight. Some people are extremely overweight and are obese. 
other people are naturally slim, but others look have absolute, absolutely, 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 no fat on them and are thin or skinny. Okay, good. Uh, okay, it says people are building all shapes and sizes, repeat sizes, because sizes. total size, correct. There are those who are fat. Okay, uh, we are going to see that. In overweight, some people are extremely, repeat, extremely, extremely. Extremely. Overweight. Extremely. Over overweight. Are obese. Are obese. Okay. The words in, in orange, don't use them, please, with people, because that is offensive, very offensive. The class is about describing people, uh, people phys in physical appearance, but please don't use them in in real conversations with people because that is very impolite okay fat don't use fat and overweight and obese less menos okay good um uh -huh, naturally slim what is slim delgado, or uh -huh, delgado. Over, overweight delgado. Oh, what is overweight gordo ah uh, no no precise. sobrepeso, Con sobrepeso. sobrepeso. Uh -huh. fat Gordo. 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 This one is? Obeso. 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 Okay, those are bad words. Thin? Thin. Laco. Uh -huh. Delgado, okay. Delgado. Delgado. Skinny, mm. what is skinny? It is mathematical. Yeah. Uh, no. Uh, okay, we are going to see. We are going to see. Okay, good. Uh, in the picture. Sí, es delgado. Okay. Uh, yeah, but look at the guy. This is a skinny person. Okay, very more than is more than thin mm -hmm. or more than slim. Más que delgado. Too much, in other words, demasiado. Okay, that you can see mm. his bones. Le puede ver los huesos. huesos. Uh -huh. Okay, that's skinny, huesudo. Okay, or too too thin, demasiado flaco. Okay, in, in the word that we were we were reading, overweight and heavy. Mm -hmm. Heavy is another term. Okay, but and this one is short. Short. Tall. 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 Okay, good. Other words for describing people on build are stocky. You can use this stocky. one. Stocky. Repeat it. Stocky. 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 Tall. Tall. Oh, lean. What is lean? Lean. lean. With very, very, very little fat. Fat. Very no fat. fat. Okay. F what is fat? What is the noun? Fat. Fat. Gordo. Not, not the adjective. Oh. No. No, no. The adjective. The noun. Okay. Relate. Adjective. Fat. Gordo. But oh, the God. noun. What is the noun of fat? Uh -huh, fat. Oh, what see. is fat? Mm, no. Uh, food with with a lot of fat, maybe. Maybe you can think about. Uh -huh. Comida con? Grasa. grasa. Okay, grasa. fat is grasa. Okay, the um, noun. The noun, correct. Okay, good. Uh, wiry, what is wiry? Wiry. Wiry, quite wiry. thin, but muscular and athletic. Ah, uh, muscular and athletic. We don't have any, any people with that description. No. Okay, but that is, that is lean. Okay, with uh, uh, exercise, con ejercicio. Good. Uh, well proportioned uh, is generally attractive in all their body. Okay, well proportioned, like figurita in Spanish, right? Yes. Uh -huh. Okay, good, figurita. Okay, we're gonna see that. What else, what else can you see? Uh -huh. Next, after uh, well proportioned, what is the next? The next word. What is the next word? Corvicious. Repeat. Corvicious. Corvicious. Ah, what is that? This one. For. For. And our glass figure. Glass figure. Like and. Like and. Film star. Uh, there is a person very uh, very famous in in the in the movies industry long ago. Mm. Uh, mm, Marilyn. Uh -huh. Marilyn Monroe, Monroe, of course. She was very curvaceous, right? Curvaceous, curvilinear. Yes or no? Yes. 
Yeah, or the yeah. ones who know her. Okay, perfect. That's why it says 1940s film star. 1940s long ago. Okay, good. Fit? Fit. Healthy. Fit. Healthy. Healthy. Active. 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 To be fit. Active. To be fit. To be fit. To be fit. Play. 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 Plenty. Plenty. Oh, okay, that means that you need to exercise a lot to be fit. Okay, be fit the, the gym. Good. And flabby, what is flabby? flabby. When your muscles when your when your muscles go soft, go soft. Go soft. For what example, do you mean? when you go when soft. you when you uh when you talk to some people and their muscles are like like aguado, uh -huh. <laughs> in other words, uh -huh, flabby. Can you guess the meaning? No. Uh huh. No. No. Okay. So no. when you when you don't know the the meaning of something, you can use uh, these. Uh, this tool okay flavi let's see flavi uh -huh. correct or for uh, for men too Flavie. for men too okay that's flavi okay good that is something about physical appearance let's uh okay it says never never say someone is overweight or is obese okay please avoid those words i can it as a palabras okay next what is next What's next? Coloring. 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 Okay, what is coloring? Someone coloring. You can. You can describe someone as an you English role. Okay. If they have fair hair and fair skin. Fair skin. Fair skin. Very white. Very white. Of skin. Very skin. Very white. Of the skin. Someone, someone with this complexion does this and has to be and careful, has to be careful to be in the you sun. Also you be can be also be blonde or in a fair complexion. Okay. okay, what is it? What is talking about? Okay, it's uh, basically telling you people who are very white, okay, in, about their skin or their hair. And even the eyes, the eyes, okay? Those are English rows, okay? That's a term, that's a term. Es un término que se usa. But it's not common, okay? Or fair skin, fair hair, etc. But we know that for women, we can say that she is blonde. She's blonde. blonde. Okay, she is, what is blonde? Blonde. Uh -huh. What is blonde? Meaning, meaning of blonde? Blonde. Uh -huh. What is blonde? What is blonde? The meaning, the meaning, the meaning. What is the meaning of blonde? Rubia. Okay. And for men, for men, para hombres, white, white or Caucasian. 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 White or Caucasian. Good. Okay. Let's continue. You are born. You are born. You are with born color with color white color or white or white or black or, or Asian. You can okay. also you can say the same person or for example, a woman or a man 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 or a Okay, what is what is important in this paragraph? Okay, when you see people about his color, his skin color, don't say colored. Okay, don't say colored. Or don't say black because that's offensive too. Asian, in the case of her, she's from Asia. Okay, she's from maybe Japan Asia. or Korea, any China. other country. Korea. China, maybe too. Okay, China. but um, Asian, she's from, you can say she's from Asia. Okay, but Asia. Asian, um, not so good, not tan bien. Okay, in, in the case of him, you can use man, he's a man of. Color. color, hombre de color, but never, never black because no, that's not correct. In African, African, African American, American. American. Okay. he is, he is, he is African American. He is man of color. Okay, yeah, he's a man of color. You can say that, 
okay but no never black never black okay uh, clear clear on that yes, yes. okay per perfect perfect let's continue next is face the face so what do face. we have about the faces okay faces like build very a lot varían mucho very a lot some people have oval repeat oval Oval faces. Okay. Do how how is my face? Do I have oval face or a round face or long face? In my case, you can look at me through the camera. Uh huh. How a is round it? face? I have a round face. Yeah, I have a round face. That's that's why I am a little bit cachetón, right? I eat too much, maybe sometimes. <laughs> okay, but that happens. That happens. Okay, their foreheads. Uh -huh. Their foreheads. What is foreheads? Frente. Are much are much wider than their chins. What is chins? Barba. Chins. Um. Okay. Other people have a hard shape. Is square. Okay. What is a square? Round face, like me, like me, for example. Okay, here's some vocabulary for describing features. Okay, mm, let's see the pictures. Bushy eyebrows. Okay, what is that, teacher? Okay, look at look at the look at the hair eyebrows. How are they? With a lot of hair, with a lot. In amount, in cantidad. Okay, in Spanish, what is what is the translation that you can give to that? Mm -hmm. Bushy, bushy eyebrows. Cejas. Las cejas. Uh, las cejas, cejas but cejas, people yeah. in El Salvador don't say las cejas. Uh -huh. People se in El Salvador se juda. <laughs> oh, se juda. Se juda. <laughs> okay, but that is those are our terms. Esos son nuestros términos. But in English, people say bushy, bushy eyebrows, eyebrows, okay. eyebrows, eyebrows. Okay, it's just lots of thick, thick hair on your eyebrows. A lot, eyebrows. A lot of hair. Correct, a lot of hair. And next, the the girl, crooked, crooked teeth. What is that? Uh huh, crooked teeth. Uh, let's see. Hey, where is it? Bush eyebrows, a hooked nose. Okay, it maybe it's after that. But what no. can you guess? What can you guess from the picture of the girl? Crooked Friends. teeth. Uh huh. Not not very, not very, not the same in in size. That's why she is using brackets. Uh -huh. Disparejos. Disparejos. Disparejo. Torcido. Torcido, disparejo, etc. Pando, pando. Ok, en Salvadorian, yes. En Salvadorian vocabulary, yes. Ok, good. Uh, next, a uh, hooked, hooked nose. What is that? Hooked. Ok, in the picture, the girl has a hooked nose. Nose, uh -huh. what is that? Look at the, the form of his nose, of hair, nose. Uh -huh. It's irregular, okay? It's not, it's not the same, the same line. No tiene la misma línea, okay? This pareja, correct. Okay, that's a hook nose, hook nose. Next, person with? Person with dimples. What, what are dimples? What are dimples? Duelos. Uh -huh. It says when you get, uh, when you get hollows, mm -hmm. little hollows, uh -huh. hollow. uh -huh. in your, in your cheeks, cheeks, or next to your mouth, or when you a smile. And... When, for example, okay, uh, little, you, little holes. Little holes. Uh huh. Okay. Uh, hollow. Holes. Mm, you can say holes, hoyos. But the, the other word that you can use is hollows. Okay, hollow. you, hollows. Hollows. yes, correct. Okay, uh, you can read the description uh, more in detail in, in your free time. So you can study a little bit these terms that we can use to describe people people's faces. Okay, let's see, do you know this guy? Who is he? Who's he? 
for for the ones for who know him. Ah, Dwayne Rooney. Dwayne Rooney. 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 Oh, okay. Rooney. Uh, he has. He, let's repeat. He has. A, he has soccer play. Is not. No, nope, we are no, talking was, about no, the. No, the no. Is not. Snob snob knows. Knows. What is a snob? A snob knows. And which no. goes which up, goes up at, the end. at the end. Mm, okay, like, like this. Uh -huh. It goes up at the end. Look at it. It's a little bit notice, noticeable, but not much. Okay, but you can use those terms in order to describe people's face. People's face. All right? Yes? Okay, what is next? And what is next? And we have more vocabulary we can use. Next hair. is hair. Repeat hair. 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 Okay. Hey, teacher, it that's it. That's it. Sounds like uh, the word. Okay, this one. Uh huh. Uh, this one and this one. Is it the same pronunciation? What do you think? Is it the same? Yeah. Hair. 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 Repeat here. 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 Okay, let's we can check. We can no. check in order to see. Okay, some some words have the same uh, pronunciation, but in grammar they are different. Uh, let's see. Hair. Here. 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 Okay. And here. Here. Okay, hair. that is uh, the subject, the subject pronoun here. Okay, let's see. Let's check. Um, is it different or no? Huh. Mm, okay. Mm, kinda. Kinda. No, the thing. Not. The thing is that the the dictionary is from 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 England. Okay. It's not American, but in these cases, fur, fur, hair, mm -hmm. almost the same. Okay, hair. almost the same. A small difference. Very small. Okay, let's continue with uh, the vocabulary that we have. Okay, what do you th what do you see in the first picture? First picture. Uh huh. Curly. Long. Curly. Curly. What is what is curly? Uh huh. Long. Okay. Largo. No, it's colocho. Curly. Curly hair. Yeah. Next one is short. 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 short, 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 short hair. Hair. Yeah. What is what is the meaning? Short, striped hair. Corto. Corto. Liso. Uh -huh. Cortito, liso. Okay, yeah. hair. Okay, next. Wavy. 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 What is wavy? What's a wavy? Lulado. Regno. Lulado. Okay. <laughs> this one. Going, bold, going, bold. What is bold? Ah, que se está going, okay. Going, bold. Okay. Good. Next. Red, 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 Mm, cabello rojo. Mm. Pelirroja. Ah, Pelirroja. Okay. She is. Okay, she is. Ah. She is. Red. Red, red hair. hair person. Red hair. Okay, she is a red hair person. Pelirroja. Correct. Next. Resident hairline. hairline. What is? What? Who is a person uh, with a resident hairline? Ah, okay. It seems that this person uh -huh, is losing hair. Está perdiendo cabello. Yeah, that's, that, that's why it says receding. Correct. Okay. Receding. Okay. Que se está. Okay. That he is going, that he soon is going to be bold. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe he's going bold. Okay, next. French. Uh -huh. French. 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 What is the French? French. Uh -huh. The hairstyle. The hairstyle. Hair right. Okay. And this one. This is a lighter, by the way. Shaved. Shaved the hair. What was that? Shaved the hair. Shaped hair. What is that? Pelón. 
Pelón. Pelón. Rapado. 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 Pelón in. Pelón is in Spanish, in our culture. But in the normal vocabulary, is rapado. Okay, rapado. good. Rapado. Yes. No, pelón. Pelón, what's that? Okay, mm -hmm. next. Ponytail. Pony. Pony. Ponytail. What is ponytail? Pony. The hairstyle. Tipo de cabello, Pola, de ponytail. Cola de caballo. Yeah. Cola de caballo. Ponytail. Okay, good. Okay, good. And let's see, you have the terms in this part, so you can practice and read them about how to learn, give descriptions about the terms that you see in the slides. Okay, um, let's see, receding hairline, a red hair with a red hair. Okay, basically it's the same. Here, what is the next part? Here. Are some, are some ways are some you can describe hairstyles. Okay, hairstyles, okay. When you go to the salon, you can request for a cut. Cut in a bob. bob. Cut in a, a bob. bob. What is in that? Bob. In a bob. Uh -huh. a, a short, short hairstyle. A short hairstyle. Where the where hair, hair, hair comes, comes down. down. Okay, when the hair to comes you, down. Okay, to similar to, to this. Similar, I guess. Okay. Yes. A fringe. What's a fringe a a hairstyle? A fringe. What is it? A fringe. What is it? Horizontal. Horizontal. Across. Okay. Okay. We don't say horizontally. No, we say horizontally. Horizontally, horizontally, horizontally across across the across, across her forehead the forehead okay what is the fringe the fringe hairstyle is this one fringe okay fringe 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 fringe, fringe. 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 correct and the ponytail you know it and this is another hairstyle that is mohican a mohican okay what's that Okay, can you read it? A punk style where a punk style where you hair is shaved is strange on the sides, but longing but picky in the middle. This picky in the middle. Okay, you can investigate about a Mohican a hairstyle. Okay, that's only a hairstyle. That is uh, something that you can use to describe uh, people's uh, type of hair. Oh, all right, all right. Questions uh, until this part? Any? No? All right. It's uh, uh, only mainly vocabulary that you can use to learn. Okay, next, uh, we have next is about... Mm -hmm. On skin surface. Surface, on skin surface. 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 Okay, let's look at the pictures. The first one is a person that has freckles. 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 Okay, repeat the freckles. 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 Okay. freckles. Those are the, the dots. Let's see. Uh -huh. Correct. The dots that the girl has around her face. All around her face, freckles. Okay, like for example, uh, Pippi, Pippi Longstocky, the the history for the book, uh -huh, that she has a freckles, Pippi. Good, Pippi Longstocky, yes. Okay, the next picture, what is the next picture about? About the skin, the skin surface. Skin the skin, skin tags. What is that? Any idea? Uh -huh. Mm, not precisely, no, lunares, no. These ones are lunares, moles, repeat. Moles. Moles, moles are lunares. Moles. But skin tags? Verrugas. Verrugas, verrugas. Verrugas. Let's see, let's uh, investigate, let's use the tool. Uh -huh. Skin tag, let's see. Mm, no, right? That's not the meaning. Okay, skin tag. Sometimes Google Translate doesn't work. Skin 
tax. Let's investigate a little bit. Because keen tax. That's it. Uh, our small to soft skin color growths on your skin. Larberrugitas, yes. Okay, similar to them. Good. All right, let's see. What else do we have? Our molds, we have already molds. mentioned that word. And the next one is? Lunares. Uh, the Bim. molds, molds are molds. lunares, molds. molds. Okay. And the next one? Spots, people, okay, people that people that suffer from this, que sufren de esto, okay, this is like uh, something, uh -huh, spinillas, spots, etc. Next, word, what is a word? What is a word? A word is bigger than a skin tag. A skin tag is small. But a word is? Okay, yes, correct. Okay, correct. Next. Wrinkles. 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 Do you have a wrinkles wrinkles. around your eyes? Uh -huh. Do you have any wrinkles? Guys, do you have? Let, let me check. Get close to the camera so I can see if you have wrinkles around your eyes let's see no no i cannot see from here okay wrinkle next okay we have a baby in the picture the word is what is what is birthmark what is a birthmark do you have Marca any? Marca de nacimiento. Ah, okay, correct. Marca uh -huh. de nacimiento. Marca de nacimiento, Marca de or in nacimiento. other words, in other words is? Hmm? Nave de sangre. Lunares. Ah, no. Lun no. No, molds are lunares, molds. Manchas. Molds are lunares. Manchas. Manchas. No, birthmark. Birthmark, what is a birthmark? Uh, no. I don't know this. Okay, eh, cicatriz, birthmark. Okay, marca de nacimiento is una cicatriz, okay, in, in Spanish. But in English, it's a birthmark. Birthmark. All right, Bird. okay, let's continue. Let's see if we have more vocabulary to study. Ah, okay, more vocabulary and practice. 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 It says using the Okay. Uh, those are three links that you can use instead uh, for you to study and practice more vocabulary. You're going to see that in English we have a lot of things that we can learn. Okay. When you paste the link, you are going to find these uh, useful a website is pretty interesting and you're gonna see a lot of vocabulary in this website face beginning with face adjectives to describe physical physical appearance physical appearance appearance, appearance. Yeah. appearance. appearance. okay appearance a facial facial features is Rasgos. Okay, if you want Rasgos. to say, ah, she has, uh, ya tiene muchos rasgos. Uh -huh. You can use, ah, she has many facial, facial, facial features. features. Okay, <laughs> beautiful facial features. Okay, ah, uh, she has, can you read it? Read it. She has, she has, she has a thin face. Thin face. face. Thin or you are saying, in other words, Okay. Next, next, uh, next to the English sentence, there is the translation or the Spanish equivalent. A noble, a noble face. A noble face. Noble face. You know, you know, you have the, the description next to next to you. Okay. Uh, next around. Around face. Face. Like me. face. Like me. Okay. Good. Clean. Clean. Shaven. Okay. Shaven. Uh, in in this in this moment, I am not clean shaven. Okay, because I have beard. Good. Next. 
a bloated a bloated a bloated face what is a bloated face okay good next a cherubic a cherubic a cherubic face, cherubic face. Ah, what is the meaning una cara angelica Angelica, that, that can be for children or for people too in general. Okay, people who are very good looking. Okay, good looking is an adjective that you can use to describe people. What is good looking? Uh -huh. Good looking. Good looking, good. In, in appearance. Very, uh, very uh, this is another term for attractive. Attractive. attractive yes it is the same a uh, good looking is for men and women okay men como lucy yeah men and women for both okay attractive you can use it for men and women too okay for men and women but beautiful uh -huh. beautiful is for, for men or women Women. Only women, women, yeah. Only for women. Okay. And the equivalent, the equivalent of that is handsome. Handsome. And this only is a, this is for men, correct? Men. Only men. Handsome. Okay, but we have two adjectives that you can use for both. The first one is good looking. Good looking. Good looking. Or, uh -huh. attractive. 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 Uh, attractive, attractive or attractive? attractive. Uh -huh. attractive. We have a pronunciation issue, okay? Attractive is attractive. No, it's attractive. not attractive, it's attractive. attractive. Let's, see. The, let's see the stress. Attractive. Uh, on the second, second syllable. Attractive. 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 Okay, good. And you can continue exploring the website. You're going to find many things. See? The rots. Words. There is. Wrinkles. Uh, wrinkles. 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 Okay. Correct. And you have more. More vocabulary. And you have uh, the other two links that you can use. We have two links more. Let's see. It's is it about uh, more vocabulary or exercises about appearance? Let's find. Ah, okay. This is the website that I like using. Appearance one. This is practice for you. You can do it at home when you have free time. See, you can use uh, the words that we have been studying during the class: a fat, a short, a slim, etc. So you can get more of this vocabulary and you have activities. One, two, three, you have a lot, a lot of material that you can use to study. All right? There are two, there are two links, two links more and three in total. Okay. All right, guys, uh, this was today's class. And please, this is a material that you can study uh, to do the assignments in the platform. Don't forget, you can practice with them. Practice with the links before doing the other exercises. Okay, guys, all right. Thank you for being in the class. We are gonna stop at this moment and we are going to see you in tomorrow's class, until tomorrow's class, all right? See you tomorrow, Tisha. See you okay. tomorrow, Tisha. See you tomorrow. Yes. 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 Take care. Have a good night. Good night. Have a great night. You Thank too. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you. Thank you so much. See you. See you tomorrow night.